Hey, welcome back to my new video. This is Sampath. You're watching Sampath Sanfx YouTube channel, and this is Poco F3 the Mi 11X custom ROM reviews. Back with new video, guys. This is nothing but this the Pixel OS. Recently, I have made a Pixel OS fan edition. What is the difference between that and this? I will going to explain this. No benchmark results, nothing in this video. Everything remains same. Android version is 14 here. Again, February 5, 2024 is the security patch. Kernel user is 4.19.306. And this is the typical home screen what we get. And these are the apps I have installed. Straight away the status here. Safety nets get passed in that particular video. It was not getting passed. Check out that video and come back here. And this is the quick settings toggles what we can get here. Into the edit sections. There are some more options as you can see. There is no Dolby Atmos for some reason here. Yeah. Now moving into this here home settings you get that pixel launcher you get all the options at a glance there are plenty of options again that remains same and if you go into this one home wallpaper sun style here also the lock skin as you can see that's the android 14 feature it's still available working fine into the home skin more wallpapers it's taking a little bit of time here yeah a wallpapers are also given here and on device wallpaper this one that's it uh, nothing changed here. now moving to settings you guys can see it's very similar to uh, pixel OS fan edition also but underneath there are some differences into the gestures here you get navigation mode gesture navigation you will get that hide gesture bar option here three button navigation is there so you have to screenshot double tap to check the phone that's there and we will show this location i mean google maps are everything is working fine as you can see i'm using google maps are also working fine no problem regarding that regarding security and privacy you get both face unlock and fingerprint unlock even extend unlock and bluetooth unlocking features are there let me show you the fingerprint unlock first as you can see it is working fine actually and the face unlock is also very much quick to unlock your smartphone using both face unlock and fingerprint unlock here yeah now we'll come back into other settings like wallpaper and style remains same what i already shown here you get this icon manager again that's there and display size and text are also given just here colors there are these options available and refresh rate you get only 60 and 120 whereas in the fan edition you are getting 90 hertz and here you get adaptive refresh rate also if want you can disable that and completely force into 120 hertz refresh rate dc dimming is there high brightness modes that's present here also and moving into sound and vibration again here there are no direct sound settings here too vibration and haptics are given here individually you can select them and battery thermal profiles are given battery usage hasn't recorded it battery saver you get these options charging control is given you'll get that mode again everything remains same nothing so different here just that display settings apart from that everything is same and each and everything will going to be similar to that particular ROM why that named as fan edition I don't know but this how the kernel difference and other differences what you can observe let me know in the comment section guys if you have any specific questions regarding this particular on the pixel OS or the pixel OS fan edition i'll be answering them in the comment section itself if you are still not joined the whatsapp group of this pimi linux i recommend you to join there and we'll meet you with another interesting video guys until that keep smiling bye bye for now